Not gonna lie. I love that transition screen. <laughs> Did you see it? Did you see it? I, I, I see, see it, it, it every time. I want to see it again. One more time. One more time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at it. <laughs> so God, clean every time. Hot. Every single time. It's so hot every oh, single time. One day, Beardy. Let me just tell you. Let me turn this down a little bit. It's gonna be recognized by more people mm -hmm. than just uh, than just us. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And them uh, bitches and them hoes gonna see it. Exactly. It's gonna start off small, but BD, the BBP man. I'll never be able to cut off my bun. Why do you still have no. your bun? You're 50. Yeah, but I still I'll have a podcast. I'll never be able to shave either. No, no, no. no you're. Probably ever I mean, was anyway, yeah. <laughs> I I low key want to get to the point where I do grow better beard than more than this just stash. Like, if I had that look, like what our logo is, bro. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, man. Fucking yeah. sexy as fuck. Yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah. All day. All day. But listen, we're here today because a lot of uh, you guys got to realize, you know, if if we're listening on different um like places, like platforms. So you, some of you are listening on YouTube, watching us. Some of you are listening to us live on Twitch. Maybe other others are watching or listening to us on Spotify. Spotify. Um, we l asked our viewers and the people who are around our Discord uh, to give us the next topic or thing that they wanted us to do. And a lot of them, you know, a lot of them spoke about and told us they wanted to see some kind of tier list between us. And uh, words were spoken. We have, or typed both. You know what I mean? <laughs> typed and as well as spoken <laughs> it was spoken yes. it was typed it was a little bit of both and um we beardy and i just got together and then ended up just saying you know what this is a good idea and we ended up just coming up with a tier list and then we asked we asked further chat to say hey guys what do you guys want to like what would you guys like to see like what topic on the tier list and we came in and we decided to do a childhood cartoon tier list oh yes <laughs> that's right so right that's right for the people who are not our age beardy and i we were born in the 90s yeah whatever no, don't oops. don't cringe 90s baby you know what i'm saying early um, 90s baby yeah i was 91 that's a I different was, breed I was yeah. Good. yeah 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 and you were 93 93 <clears throat> mm -hmm. so we're there and um we chose a lot of the early like cartoons that we both saw and liked and figured we'd go uh, go, go ahead and uh tear it out uh beardy it made you show how you know i don't know about you beardy but i felt a little old doing oh this. when i saw half those shows <laughs> aired in 1994 yeah <laughs> trust me it made me feel a little old yeah you to start to you start to really take into consideration how old and how long these shows have been out mm. and about you know, and by the way, chat, uh, what up, Rogue, by the way? Um, if you do want to see the tier list that we, or the, the the cartoons that we're using, it is on Discord. It is under podcast. I believe same thing on Beardy's uh, Discord. Uh, if you guys yep. just want to look at it that way and get to see, we, we put, like, when the first um, episode aired on there as well. All right? It's all for display, my brother. All, all of it display. For display. So, how did you feel, Beardy? Like looking back at some of these, like cartoons. How did that make you feel? A aside, rush. aside from old. Aside from old. Forget, <laughs> forget the how old you are part. Right? How did that? Um, how did that actually make you feel? Looking at some of these and saying, you know, I used to watch this when I was a lot younger. I used yeah. to like. You know, give a lot of time. I used to know about this story. You know what I mean? How did that make you feel? It makes me wonder. I mean, not old, but, you know, it makes me wonder when, where the time goes, you know? It's just, it just feels like it was point. just yesterday. I was sitting in my living room watching that shit. But I don't know. It's just, those shows just bring so much nostalgia, man. It just makes you think it used to be so much simpler. It was just so much easier when those would come on every day or every yeah. like, Saturday or Sunday morning or whatever. And you know all you really had to worry about was homework or like some little dumb romance in high school or not, <laughs> no, 
not high school, so more like middle school and under. And it's like, God, I, I just wish I could have soaked it up, you know, just it, soaked up more of that time back then. It's insane. When we were going through these, it was like, like one of those like feelings of, I remember, I remember yeah, the, exactly. the times when I was watching this. I was Scotty. just smiling like the whole time we were looking at those TV The shows. entire time. Yeah. And we should have streamed that part because that was giddy yeah, as fuck. Honestly. Uh, Scotty, thank you so much for the sub, bro. How you doing? Uh, Avatar was the shit. It still is the shit, by the way. But so ultimately, cool. like with me, it was the same feeling. I I started to think of, wow, like it really has been not only a couple of years since I've seen some of these shows, because a lot of these I I don't I don't necessarily watch like I used to. You know, they're not yeah. airing. You have to kind of find them. But like it was insane going back and be like, oh my god, I. I remember the little like sound that it made or um <laughs> like all of these little sayings that some of these made it was um it, it was it was one of those nice feelings of like like you said pure nostalgia yes. um i mean ultimately uh one of those things that we're gonna say remember we're gonna we're gonna highlight the messages just so we can kind of remember but i'll i'll answer that one actually rogue 100 percent um you're like influenced by the culture like same same thing as mexican kids like i was going to be influenced different than you are just because i lived in mexico um i see your point about americans and british maybe the same shows are in english but people watch different shows because i don't know it's what's available sometimes you know also you know like we're talking about nostalgia i honestly still watch a lot of older cartoons like i think in my last apartment i remember or some recently, I watched like the entire, was it Hey Arnold series? Or at least really? Some of it. And I bought the first season. We forgot to do this one. Kids Next Door. You remember that shit? <gasps> I bought the first season on my <gasps> Xbox. I never finished watching it, but man, that shit was good to go back. There's and no again. way. It really was. There's no way the Kids Next Door. Can you check when the Kids Next Door first aired? That might have been. It, yeah, it might have yeah, been I'll later. It might have been later because there's it no way we missed late. that. There's no way we missed that because yeah, I, I definitely it, watched but... that. And if it, if it aired before 2005, we fucked up. 2002. No shot. 2002. How was that I don't not? Know how, I don't know how. That wasn't that. on that list. Oh, I we fucked that up. That show too. No, I, I agree. That. Yeah, we, that I show should have been on here. One. All right, we fucked up, chat. It should have been 23 Usually. shows. 23 shows, not 22. That was so unique, man. That one was so different. Now that we got to talk about this one that wasn't on, you know what? Let's start off with that one, right? Kids Next yep. Door was one of those, like, for me, like, think about... You see, I don't know about you guys, but... Uh, of course it is, Scotty. Come on now. Um, uh, it was one of those, like, I moved around as a kid, right? So I had, I had to make friends, and I had a lot of different friends growing up. I never had the same friends, right? So I just always imagined being able to have the same friends and being able to, like, really go into the whole, like, uh, imagination part of it. You know what I yeah. mean? Like, in Kids Next Door, you were already gone when you were a certain age. Dude, <laughs> yeah. I always, I was that, always I hated like... I that part, man. That kind of that kind of killed me. I know. <laughs> but it was like, they never were good. It was goddamn teenagers. <laughs> they were always dickheads. Every <laughs> single time, the teenagers, they were always doing that. <laughs> what number was your became, favorite? they became, like, their own fan group. So I don't know. It was kind of, it's kind of different. Who was your favorite number? Uh, I mean, I think I want to say four because he was the coolest and most badass. I feel like like the hardest. What was who was number four? Who was number four? He was the tiny little yellow orange jacket blonde kid. Wasn't that number two? I thought that was number two. No, no. Number number two is the fat uh, little one that wore the goggles. Oh, that was Hoagie. my guy. That was two. my guy. Number four was Wallaby. He was the Australian kid. <laughs> yes. Wally. Yes. Number four was a badass. I agree, dude. My favorite was probably the big. I was going to say the big kid. He was just my favorite guy because yeah, yeah, I've yeah, always yeah, been a big was, guy. I was going to say, he's, he's the funniest one. Usually. He's so good. That was my favorite. Honestly, if I had to... If I had to uh, put that up there i i probably wouldn't put it in in s tier personally mm -mm, but no, like i'm i i'm pretty good i'm pretty okay saying it's pretty pog champion put it <laughs> it's at a champion. you know it's pog champion yeah so i'm gonna go uh, with a i would put it a what do you think yeah it was definitely deserves an a yeah 
Kids Three Next Door, A. It's not on here, chat, but you know what? We got to... In our hearts. It's in our hearts, and we fucked up. That, that's not on here, because I really did enjoy <laughs> that. So, um, Rugrats hits differently, and then Cow and Chicken better be on here. Cow and Chicken better is is in here. Um, and so is Rugrats. I agree. They they both hit different. So, sh do we, do we want to start off with just, like, in order? Or, Chad, do you guys want to have us talk about one? You guys have the list on Discord. If anybody, whoever, like highlights their message first saying which one you guys want us to talk about well uh dennis the menace to that's to just to be sure who's dennis the menace dennis the menace is a cartoon it's not a cartoon that's why i'm thinking say, cartoon yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not a cartoon right not a cartoon. yeah no. I, I i definitely it watched it yeah it was like <laughs> a live show a live show <laughs> a live show totally spies first done all okay. right totally spies all right you know what? This was mostly Beardy's. Beardy got really excited when Totally Spies came out. But then I also, I also realized, holy shit. I used to watch a lot of them. Like, you remember, you remember <laughs> the fucking mirror that they would fucking do yeah. your makeup on? Yeah. And then they would shoot lasers through the mirrors uh -huh. to fucking get through places. You already know. I was about it. And like, let's just be real. If your favorite Total, totally spy wasn't the orange one you're fucking wrong or yellow whatever fuck color it is like you're wrong the redhead oh, was cute know. too that, that blue one that blonde one kind of <laughs> the red kinda hits differently yeah. i went with orange the blonde, dude the blonde is like uh, i don't know yeah you know. no I'm, I'm going with orange i'm telling you but what about you what, what was what, what made you go into this watch this one so much I, I don't remember again some of these it's been so long i can't remember exactly why i just remember that i watched them a lot so some of them i don't really have a reason i just remember hey i remember watching that show at least decently often as a kid but it was just so long ago some of them aren't as significant as the other ones right. so honestly i can't really rank this one as high because it doesn't sit as well in my head like oh it's top it wasn't high right being away kind of good like it was just kind of kind of different you know like three totally spot oh my god i literally just said the title three girls <laughs> that are totally fucking spies you know i just said it again for me I for me I, did, I just didn't, didn't even have many like places to talk about them with people like not many people yeah. watched it when i remember like, hey, yo boys did you see the totally episode? spies episode where they were like girls it's girl power and like no i just i'll be honest i i would put it at c like it's there yeah. memories there it's i don't consider it trash know your place um yeah. but like i would go with c it's sad worthy you know what i mean it's you I put it agree on with c for totally yeah spies for sure yeah i, I, I go with c because if i if i remembered it more i would give it b but i guess it didn't stand out enough for that it just it was it was good and i i still remember it but yeah i'm gonna go with c I have uh, Dead Show, Powerpuff Girls, All Grown Up, Bitch, Please. <laughs> Wait, I haven't seen it yet. I haven't. Is that I, is I that wouldn't. I wouldn't even. I don't even know, but I just wouldn't. Like, certain shows like that, in my opinion, just need to be kept the same. Samurai Jacks was hands down the most impressive cartoon I ever watched those days. So much effort put into animation, a ton of passion in the story. Yes. Dude. Samurai Jack is so cool. Samurai Jack is insane. Bro. Yeah. We we wanted to Scotty, we wanted to do uh <laughs> we wanted to do ones that we watched together as opposed to like having ones that just he watched and then I watched. So like yeah, we I watched a lot of Kim Possible. He said he did not like it at yeah, all. I, I didn't know I, I liked it. It just he I never like watched it. it. Yeah, watched he didn't like watch it. I watched a lot much. of it. The naked mole rat, fucking Ron. <laughs> like, yeah, no, I watched it a lot. They, Boy, they, yeah, I, I I did end up enjoying that show a lot, actually. Um, let's see. I guess because it was kind of talked about, do you want to do Powerpuff Girls? Yeah, yeah. Like, since Powerpuff we Girls. go in that, that, you know what I mean? I, <clears throat> personally, I think Powerpuff Girls is a, it's an A. It's pretty Pog Champion. But, like, like who, like, what about it? Like, I'm telling you, I, like, who's your favorite? It was... Who's your favorite bubble? Like, oh, shit. I, did I? Oh. I, I, I might have <laughs> yeah, given mine out. Away who the fuck your favorite Wait, is what? right there. I might like who bubbles, your dude. Bubbles and why was she your favorite? I'll tell you right uh, now. No, I'm just kidding. Bubbles was not my favorite. I'll tell you who, I though. I think Bubbles is my favorite. Actually? I think, I think Bubbles is my favorite, yeah. She's sweet, nice. Um, 
bucket. What's her name? The butch one. What's the butch one? The green oh. one? <laughs> she yeah, was. She's one. my favorite, bro. Yeah, I mean, she's I forget okay. Her like, she's name. hardcore, but I, I can't just, check it because I can't. I have a lot of shit. Little too much of a bitch, and then the brown hair is just you know so generic. I don't know. Bubbles is it for me for sure. Bubbles is like one of those like don't. She's so nice, but do not piss her off. Like as soon yeah, as yeah, as soon exactly. as you piss her off it's butter literally cup. utter it's buttercup okay, butter dude cup. buttercup's my girl like i'm telling you buttercup's she's that like damn. she's like that tough one but also like has feelings you know what i mean mm -hmm. like that's that was like mm, i loved buttercup actually a lot like she was my favorite growing up dude i remember do you remember the episode where the kid was like eating fucking glue <laughs> yeah, and he turned and into, a glue monster. into a glue monster. This giant fucking glue monster running I, for around some all over the place. He just, remember he that? Of all the time, so he just shoveled that shit <laughs> down, and then he turned into a fucking like glue goblin. It's insane. Sticks <laughs> oh, and stones can God. break my bones, but glue will forever stick to me or some shit. I don't remember. I think the creepiest character <sighs> in that show, and there's literally no arguing this, is the fucking the devil. Whatever his name was, I think his name was him. It was just him. H I M, right? Was this the, the fucking... right show? Yeah, no, this is definitely it's definitely the same show. 100 percent It's like the red little demon horns. He's like oh. yeah. <laughs> He's almost feminine. With He's Mojo like Jojo. A girl. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's also Mojo Jojo, too. Yeah. Mojo Jojo. I, I fucking loved. I, I watched a lot of Powerpuff Girls. The whole thing nobody thinks about until they're really old, a lot older is like, what the fuck was the dad doing creating three little girls in his I basement? Know. You know what I mean? But like, <laughs> ultimately created a nice little story for us. Like, I mean, he didn't have a lady and he. I guess he just didn't want to adopt. So. <laughs> he, he did not adopt. He just you became know God instead. And I'll be honest, like, Powerpuff Girls to me is definitely pretty Pog Champion. I would put that in A. Very Pog Champion. Yeah. Absolutely. I, I, S tiers is literally, like, absolute perfection. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. Like, we're going to literally save that for for God tier, like, cartoons, God in our tier. opinion. Um, Next, I saw in on the comments is actually Samurai Jack. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know about you, Beardy, but Samurai Jack was the first cartoon of its kind that I watched personally. That kind of mm -hmm. animation, the um, kind of like swordsman, the whole samurai kind of yeah. way. And just like I said, the art style was so unique to me, but I remember being so drawn to like the excitement, like... I don't know. I actually really enjoyed uh, Samurai Jack, a hundred percent. I liked Samurai Jack a lot. I would not say it's S tier personally. I think it's A. And I can see why everybody else would say S for sure. I just like I liked it a lot. I just wasn't like completely fucking glued to it. Maybe as an adult now, if I rewatched it, it'd be kind of different. Or watched. I think Adult Swim has their own version of it now, actually. That shit's, I heard it's like really fucking violent, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, it, it just like, it was good. It wasn't fucking incredible for me, though. It didn't like completely stick. I just remember being so hyped. Now, the only reason yeah. I could kind of agree with the argument of it not being A tier, or I'm sorry, S tier, is because mm -hmm. I consider something, and I mean, I might as well give it away because it is the one that's going to be there no matter what. We might as well put it on there, to be honest, but we'll talk about it later when we do. But when I think of something like the Avatar, the the story behind it, you can make arguments that, you know, uh, Samurai Jack is on that level. But to me, personally, the way I would see it is, is like, it was too, I was too young for that show yeah. at the time. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. Samurai Jack now, I don't know if you've rewatched it, I mean, Sphinx is right. The 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 it, it hits differently when I knew more about the world than when I was yeah. that age. I think for me, I, I think about like I, that at that moment when I was that young. So like I would personally put it in A tier, like A plus. I think somebody said it in yeah. chat earlier, like an A plus kind of Sphinx said it kind yeah, of yeah. thing. No, Rogue, Rogue, uh, Rogue, yeah, Rogue, Rogue said yeah, yeah. it. Hundred percent. Um, I would I would consider that like like put put it to you this way. I would put like Samurai Jack in front of Powerpuff Girls, personally. Yeah, like I, I think so. 
Because I've yeah. I've watched this recently and it hit differently. I would that's what I'm saying. Like I remember watching this now and it being like, oh shit, fuck, I need to watch okay. that. Okay. Yeah, no, it hits differently. Where did bro. you watch that? I think it was on Netflix, dude. I'm not There's even kidding. No way it's still on Netflix. I'll check. Probably no not, but I'm on. like, I was like, ninety percent sure. Is uh, I think it would be on Netflix. All right. So the other one, I mean, it's it's on the list. It's somebody said do do Avatar next. So we might as well, bro. Let's talk. Like, actually, oh, also Rogue wants to I just donate. See Bits yeah, for... I saw that. Okay, okay. Just make sure you saw that. Let's do it. Let's just do Don Johnny Bravo yeah. though. All right, Johnny Bravo. Johnny Bravo next. Okay. Let's do Johnny Bravo. <sighs> How much did you watch it when you were younger? I watched a good bit. It was just. It was so. I, I just felt so fucking bad for that dude, man. <laughs> I felt so bad for him. There was the one side where he's just so cocky, like, oh, oh hey, mama, pretty mama. Oh yeah, exactly. Hey, mama, I want to fuck you in the ass, like that kind of shit, like that. You know, he was so horny, and it's like other than him having really tiny legs, the dude was super jacked oh and had perfect God. hair and good looks and everything. But then he could just never land him. I can't remember why, but he was just he was just blue balling it all the time. So I mean, I don't know. I I just felt bad for Johnny like the entire series. I was feeling bad for that guy. It's one of those where, again, I think it, age comes into play. I mean, Sphinx said I fucking died of laughter watching Johnny Bravo recently, but I also watched it in my native language, so some of the jokes are reworked. That is true. That is very true. Like, I, that's why I don't, I don't like to dub the versions of them in Spanish, because I know they change a lot of the dialogue up, so I'd rather yeah, just listen sure, to it in English. Different. Yeah, or a, sp uh, uh, a fucking uh, movie that's done in Spanish, I would just rather listen to it in Spanish rather than get the dub to English. But regardless, um, for me, it was one of those things. Johnny Bravo was like, yeah, you're right. I wanted to be that big. I wanted to have that hair, that confidence to talk to girls. You know, the way he did, he was never afraid to go up to any girl and say, no, he oh, mama. Oh, like he, he just God, did not care. Right. Hell. But then with <laughs> age, one of them. with age, it was one of those realizations that the guy's kind of a douche, right? A little like, bit. Like, <laughs> kind of a douche. Yeah. He's, kind he's of like, douche. oh, you have a boyfriend when it looks like you could have two. Like, kind <laughs> of shit. <laughs> Don't you leave him, mama. Come yeah. on, mama. Yeah. So it's one thing to have confidence and then talk to girls, and it's another thing that just come out blatantly, not give give her like any kind of regard of to what you're saying. I personally, I always watched Johnny Bravo. I thought it was so, and he was so dense. He was so dumb. That's kind of why I liked it too. Like I, I don't remember him being the smartest of human beings. Like, he was like more of the character of I lift things up and I put them down. Is that, yeah. it, it, you know, I don't know if I'm necessarily mistaken there, but um, personally, me, I'm putting that man mid level vibe. He was a good yeah. vibe. Like. I, I wouldn't put him in pretty Pog champion, but like I would still put him over Totally Spies because I think I'd probably watch him over Totally Spies. I would definitely watch. Well, actually, I mean, hmm, I would probably watch him over Totally Spies. Mid level <laughs> vibe I can agree with though because he's just not good enough to be A or A or over. He's just not. No, no, I'm not. No, not even close. No, no offense. I think there's a nice little cutoff there from from these. You know what I mean? Oh, you have a boyfriend? Mm -hmm. Well, let me know when you want a man friend. That's where that you came man from. Friend, mama, and mind you, I have oh. done that. Oh, the Jackie Chan oh, Adventures God. wasn't on there. Was that what? Was that a uh, Disney? That was Disney. Ah, that's why we, we, we looked at that. Cartoon Network and Nickelodeon more than Disney. That's a good point. We didn't really include Disney, and I don't know why. There, we could have probably included a couple of them. Definitely. Guys, this is, this is our first time. You know, we're learning. <laughs> it's my first time. <laughs> it's something like that. It's something like that. All right. Um, let's go in order right here. Um, I have Angry Beavers. Who remembers oh, Angry man. Beavers? I I think Angry Beavers, and it just makes me feel good. I don't know. I just think like they had that big ass fucking house out in the middle of the woods or whatever, a ton of trees around. Like they were just super goofy and weird. That was a good show, man. That was a good show. It was, again, one of those that I remember watching a lot, but I can't remember it making a huge, like, impact huge that impact, I remember yeah. a lot of the episodes. Because, again, like, I know 
like i i wish it was like you could go back to your history right like i know i watched these as a kid i sat there and uh watched a decent amount of them but like mm -hmm. i can't remember it just wasn't strong enough to really no that fucking no dead in your head yeah i don't know if anybody in chat actually did um watch this a lot more yeah, a couple people saying they can't remember um, anything from that show at all. And like I said, it's one of those things that you just don't think about. I yeah. couldn't find any donuts, so I brought some tile grout. What is that? <laughs> what Sphinx said was one of the Johnny Bravo quotes. What is tile grout? I don't even I know don't what that is. Know. It sounds like a like nasty gunk under the fucking tile to make it stick to the ground i think that's what it is i think that's what like you the layer you put under almost like laying brick i'm guessing Ew. i think that's what it is <laughs> what? okay i was right fuck yeah smart it's something like there that wow, that is smart i had no idea tile. it's a thing between tiles i think wow okay what was the next one we had i know there's a what was the next one i forgot oh so again like i was saying like i think angry beaver i'm putting it oh, C. Yeah, yeah, that's right and I'm putting it behind Totally Spies because I think I remember more about Totally Spies than I do Angry Beavers. I would say D for Angry Beavers, honestly. B. Personally, I think Angry you're putting Beavers up is there D. with with uh, Johnny Bravo. Yeah. You remember the same amount. I would amount? put it in front of Johnny Bravo. Interesting. If you, were, if you gave me those two shows to watch right now, I would watch Angry Beavers. Angry Beavers over Johnny Bravo, 100%. 100. I just remember yeah. knowing more, making more of an impact. I just think that show was a little weirder and goofier for me than Johnny Bravo. Like he was fucking stupid, but both of them were ridiculous. So what? You're so giving him a B plus. Yeah, B plus. Well, just solid B, honestly. Let's give him a solid B if that I I because yeah. I'm giving him a C, like period. Yeah. Fucking C. So let's give him a B. Like I, if that's cool, like I, I think that's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All yeah, right, B is fine with me. All right, if we're going in order here. I have Avatar, and that just like I'm sorry, but like without a question, no, Avatar. There's literally no even argument, <laughs> contemplation. That is easily fucking s. Sphinx, yes. if 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 like I would say, definitely give it a try. Like it, it like, I watched this, bro. I remember what have having a whole weekend where they they played every episode from episode one oh, to the end at like certain times and me and my brother mapped it out so we watched every single episode that cannot be beaten for me when it comes to no. these cartoon shows like this is like s plus plus tier for me dude when it was out i don't think i i think it was just a dumbass i didn't know the finale was the finale so it all finished you know and kisses katara whatever they saved the fucking world and all that and it ends and i'm like okay that was cool great i can't wait for the next episode or something like that i had no <laughs> idea the series was ending and then it was I just, just find over. out at some point it's over i'm like oh my god are you kidding me no it was oh, one no. of those like endings that like i wasn't used to like it left a lot yeah. of things kind of open like what's gonna what's gonna happen next where are they gonna go mm -hmm. like i would suggest it's on netflix if you guys have netflix give it the time of day oh, is it still on netflix oh, yeah, it is, it is i think netflix. so yeah. i've honestly yeah, been thinking about just re-watching it like taking a whole weekend and just seeing if i can do all like seasons in one like two days like literally like morning to end like make it a marathon just because you know whatever i'm a loser but like honestly it's a beautiful show i learned a lot yes, from yes, it like everything is gorgeous like the it's animation so, is perfect animation, the animation for, what, like, for what kind of show it is it suits it perfectly it is we we stopped i think avatar was the cutoff that we used because i used beardy's age um to to do the cutoff my age to do the beginning 1991 his age to do the cutoff which was like 2000 what this was what 2007 it's five i think 2005 i think this was 2005 yes, i think it was 05 it was the I, newest one in the whole list did you see Scotty's uh, suggestion there? Oh, what, where is it? I can't see it. Oh, courage? Yeah. Well, and then no, Rogue not said that SpongeBob one. SpongeBob before not that. that one. Not that one. It says you should oh, at the end. Thing? You should at the end once you've decided them all be allowed one individual pick each to make a final adjustment adjustment to the tier list. And I like that. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds good. I like that. Oh, 
um no we're definitely doing spongebob next because i believe that was uh grogue that said that so let's do spongebob all right spongebob or this <sighs> should i get I mean, up you know you know what i'm saying you know what I mean? like <laughs> Why did I not even notice? That? Yeah, I'm over here like just that. like, listen. SpongeBob is literally bad, right? one of my favorite shows that has like been out for the longest fucking time. Like, again, it was another show that me and my brother just used to like watch all the time. It was on all the time. It was like, oh my god! On all the time. It just seems like you'd walk into the living room or whatever and it's just spongebob somehow constantly on there shit made history it was it was amazing um and just so you know chat i intentionally take off all notifications um because this is you know talking time i don't want anybody it's talking time. yeah i didn't want anybody like using bits to talk over us or anything like that so uh no there is no chat uh sphinx thank you and congrats on that new badge that's fucking awesome um but for me, there was times where it was like we had <laughs> and still have SpongeBob on the TV. Like it changes channels at this time to Nickelodeon just because my brother still has it set up. Like because we know that SpongeBob is going to be on that episode <laughs> on that on yeah. that channel at that time. Uh huh. Like that's how much I've always and I've always watched even the newer episodes. I'm like, oh my god, when did this happen to Sandy? Oh my God! When did that happen to Patrick? I have not seen a lot of the newer episodes. I'm I'm so far behind on that show. Well, that's what I mean. Like I, I, I don't watch know. them like that, but like when I do, yeah. I'm like I still remember the people's names. Mm -hmm. Like yeah, I I watch this show a lot. I watch this show a lot. I can't put it like word, at, word. on top of yeah Avatar, but I'm putting it in S tier if you ask me. Yeah, it deserves S tier 100. Like I'm putting it behind Avatar. The first couple seasons are great. But it like, got really stupid and random after that, I feel like. But it definitely has earned S tier. There's no, no It's just been there. around too long. Like, And it's just, yeah. like I said, like Literally it's one of my favorites. On the knows that fucking show. Who's your favorite character? I mean, I want to say SpongeBob, but I think Patrick because he's just a fucking idiot. <laughs> he's just so <laughs> yeah. stupid. Like, some of the shit that comes out of his mouth in that show is just unbelievable. Oh, my uh, God. What was it? Uh, oh, my God. I can't think of anything on top of my on top of my head, but I just we all know, we all fucking know Patrick. Patrick is is just I mean he lives under a fucking yeah. rock. <laughs> like I'm sorry, rock. but like that's enough said. You know what I'm saying? Catherine agrees with you, Patrick. One hundred percent. You know what I mean? I fuck, like that's just actually just now clicking. That's just now clicking. He lives under a fucking rock. <laughs> that's oh my god! It's all making sense now. It's all making sense now. Wow. <laughs> Holy shit. Why did that take no so way. long? No way. No way. I remember thinking about that. Like, it's the same kind of, like, reaction you had. I'm like, this man lives under a freaking rock. Like, what is happening? Why did I never realize that oh was wrong with me? Oh, my God. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Moving on. <laughs> I'm not stupid. I went to college. I went to college. I, I did the college thing. I swear. Uh, I I always liked uh, SpongeBob. I was one of those like fuck it. Like I'm not afraid to admit it. I love SpongeBob. His mm. his like way of like living and just being an idiot is just my shit. I've always enjoyed like and SpongeBob. He just got the brightest reason. outlook on everything. He just it's everything. so hard to bring that kid down. It's just he wild. He gets paid like ten cents an hour at Krusty Krab. <laughs> just loving life. <laughs> Here's your salary, Michael. Yeah. It's a fucking dime. It's a couple bucks for working all week. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Exactly. Thank you. Appreciate you. Yeah, no, for me, that's definitely S tier. And obviously, how can we forget one of the favorite episodes, period, for everybody is the Super Bowl episode. When he goes oh my in, God, yes. the winner takes yes. all. I think I need to rewatch that. <laughs> At least just that scene after we're done here. Ooh. <laughs> It gives you goosebumps anytime you think about it, no matter who and what you are. Like, I'm telling you right now. 100%. 100%. All right. If I'm not missing any, I believe there was one that somebody said courage, right? Mm -hmm. Do courage. Yeah, courage. Bro, courage the I, cowardly I know dog. Where courage goes. Yeah. Yeah. That all show right. Was so good, man. It's, that show was so bro, good. Bro, what was your favorite thing about it? It just. 
it was a horror show and they took it really far but at the same time they didn't really it was just so like the the the, the weird horror in there was so off the fucking walls yeah. half the time it was so insane like the episode with that where they went to the cat's motel oh my god that shit was Jeez. creepy and then everybody knows return to sleep <laughs> suffer my curse oh man like some of that shit just hits home so hard oh it, my god courage was so good for me it was one of those realizations later on um it was one of those like the reason why it was so out there was because it was in the perspective of him courage who yeah. is a, a dog so this is the yeah. way he saw everybody else it was like that's scary that's why they're like scared about like this over that the mailman the the everything else you know what i'm saying and i don't know i i really enjoyed that show f because of that it was like a yeah. kid's like cartoon show even to what sphinx said he said i legit didn't know that they let courage air for kids but it was so good like i i would agree like some of those moments were like damn i'm a little i'm a little bit scared you know what i mean but like it was because of like the face like i don't know the mask that they use like like <laughs> yo straight up i agree with him that hurts a little bit right yeah yeah it's a rock exception but i think it'd be hard for a lot of people to say courage is not s tier to be honest with you almost everybody i feel like i don't, Alex I don't is know so good man he's I don't such know. a wholesome little dog i, he's so I get wholesome. it he loves muriel so I'm much i'm not He'll putting him in s tier though muriel. i wouldn't put him in s tier i put him in a plus all right i mean that's decent but i just i don't know if i could put him in the same with like avatar and spongebob knows. i oh, agree he's up there with avatar and spongebob absolutely i would 100%. i would disagree I those would disagree. episodes leave a fucking mark man they're so weird and creepy and he's just so wholesome that I, they absolutely leave a mark i just don't think it's just like there's just i don't know there was it was great i'm not saying it wasn't great still good but like mm -hmm. i'm talking like when i think of absolute perfection you know avatar spongebob they've been doing it for a year I like i'm not putting absolute perfection with courage ever no offense to like uh, people i just i can't do it not not absolute perfection like i'll give it an a plus i i think it does deserve a you know i think somebody just said b plus i don't think he e goes plus? i don't think he deserves b plus at all like personally e. like he's definitely a plus but like i wouldn't say s like i would fight that one all day i do see what sphinx is saying though about it not having continuity there it was literally just an episode and then different shit another episode that was but it spongebob was kind of like that too though to an extent yeah i feel like the majority of spongebob was like that they just did the same shit over and over again or just different shit nothing ever really changed for the most part no that's fair so i don't know it, it kind of just depends that's fair like I, the only one on this list so far that has true continuity i feel like is fucking avatar no and, and samurai, samurai jack, jack. Samurai jack. Yeah, yeah samurai jack and then out of everything else i think it's just honestly for that reason alone that's probably why they should be s tier but like I that's not something on being a though i can settle for a <laughs> I'm, I'm i'm still putting him a plus i'll put him in a plus yeah, like yeah, yeah. A plus as, as higher a than plus than like uh than this yeah yeah higher than samurai jack yeah I think yeah so. sure i'll put him up yeah. higher than but like i can't i i, I can't do s I and, and like i i would disagree with scotty a thousand percent courage was great don't get me wrong but like no no <laughs> no not at all a little dum -dum. yeah yeah all right next i feel like nobody has said anything right unless we miss something i don't think so i just feel like it's a big feat for a cartoon to keep continuity and the level of production some of those shows had yeah i mean definitely and again like and that's it's kind of like an easy way out i guess just to do like a different little thing every single episode which is well, i think probably one reason why sphinx felt so heavily about samurai jack is that because it's another one yeah. yeah it's another one no because that's what i'm thinking now that i think about it no other show really has that continuity that he's talking about yeah you know what i mean Not i mean most really. of the cartoons really dumb yeah that's a good point 
Yeah, those two are. And and I, I just put SpongeBob S tier just because like it's just been prevalent forever. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like 100%. And I, you know, Courage is one of those things you think and you just, you think S tier, you just, you just do, unless you just literally hate the show for whatever reason, it just automatically is, automatically is S tier. Yeah. All right. Cat Dog is next, bro. Cat Dog was one of the first shows that I remember being like, what the fuck is this show as a kid? Like a cat and a dog <laughs> together? Like, yeah, it's weird. What? Some fucking weirdo thought of that shit for sure. Like at no uh, point did I ever think to to like think that was a, a normal thing. How they used to fight, how they used to like always go at each other. One was a cat, one was a dog, how they used to yeah. go in circles. I always thought that was so funny. I always thought that was so funny. Yeah, it was just really goofy. I don't remember it a ton. It didn't stick real, real hard. I just remember it being particularly goofy. I think I liked the dog more than the cat. I think we all liked the dog more than the cat, honestly. Cat was, cat kind, was of kind of a, dick, of a bitch. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, he was, he was the one that I feel like if I remember right, then the dog was kind of stupid, though. So, you know, the dog was balance. pretty dumb. It's that SpongeBob <laughs> kind of Patrick kind of vibes too. like yeah, the dog exactly. was pretty dumb. Almost yeah. that like pinky in the brain kind of vibes too. cats are always bitches. That's facts. <laughs> they really are, bro. What They're makes you think Samurai Jack? Cool. You know, that is a good point. Samurai Jack and Powerpuff Girls, you know, but like, hey, we're talking about us, man. You know what I mean? It's just us. I don't I don't you know, I don't know. I don't know much about statistics and shit but like yeah i go <laughs> i go with feels man <laughs> i had that shit that class in college and i forgot it man that was like a long time ago come on now cat dog was another one that i watched um a lot but again kind of like i kind of put it in in the kind of like that mid-level vibe where it's like i just don't remember much about the shows if that yeah. makes sense Mm -hmm. like is literally like i watched a lot of cat dog i remember but like as far as like impact like no, me it personally didn't really leave a mark. it didn't leave a mark yeah. i can say it, it didn't leave a mark on my cheeks or anything you know no there was no nothing. like hand imprints nothing like nothing that. No. <laughs> the only completely excuse different as said. opposed to when my parents would beat me as a kid you know it's very different it's just in general you know what i mean like i love it people are disagreeing with it i love it listen Mm -hmm. You're allowed. This is ours. I already disagree. <laughs> I think we could settle though that cat dog is fucking right average, honestly. I'm I'm going with I, average, which is just yeah, like you know mid level, mid -level vibe. vibe. You know he's chilling right I, here. I remember it fondly. It's cool and funny. I just don't remember it enough. And that's yeah, like, that's just yeah. the facts. Somebody after this wanted to do cow and chicken. Um. <laughs> so let's do cow and chicken. Cool. S plus. Right, cow and chicken. We'll cow and that. chicken was fucking weird. Bro. Okay, that show was so weird. <laughs> this is the show, Sphinx. In my opinion, that should not have been a kids show. No, like no, a it should thousand not have. percent. There was so many. Do you remember this devil? This cheeked ass devil. Like, you remember that motherfucker? He was the one with like, like. Am I thinking about hold the on, right me, show? I'm gonna Google it real quick. I yeah, can't, Google, me, hold on, Google, Google the it, yeah. the cow and chicken devil. Am I right here? Like I'm I'm like a hundred. Like all right, I, think, I don't yes, know. Yes, yes, I see right, him right now already. Right. Uh, like, oh yes, him. <laughs> he was, Ugh, dude, so I'm weird. saying oh, this God. this show was definitely not for kids, and we all watched it as kids. Yeah. <laughs> so, one of the things on Google is like, why was cow and chicken so weird? That just that's proof right the there. The cheeks on the odd. devil. I'm saying for some reason those are giant. fucking engraved, and he not in loaded. a good way, chat. I'm not saying this is my favorite show at all, but I still remember watching a lot of it. Yeah. Why? I, I think that's that's why it was so weird that it just pulled people. I think I remember firmly like one episode, the parents. Like they were just cut in half and that's just how they were they didn't have <laughs> torsos or heads or anything they were just like a walking set of legs because so i think they showed it at one point it was oh my ugh, god really awkward really weird it was literally like hey what can we get away with you know what i mean <laughs> like yeah and we're doing that yeah we should have made a whole new tier list for that and that was a weird one well i mean honestly like for for Cow and Chicken as much is not gonna say that it was one of my favorite shows, like at no. all. As much as I watched it 
I can't even say it was up there. I would honestly, like, be, it, it might be our only show that I could say would be okay with putting it on D. With his, like, I hate to no. say trash, but, like, no. it, it, it's, like, C. What? You, you put it where, where Totally Spies I is? C. I I'd say C. Do you put it with Totally Spies, though? Yeah, like, out yeah, of all of these trash. shows, the, this, this weird was weird as shit. Like, you know? I mean, like, it was weird as shit, but I think that's why I watched it. Because it was so fucking weird. I would not say it was so weird that it was trash, though. No way. No. I think C. I, I, think it I, I would say, I mean, D plus, right? Let me give you a D plus, but <laughs> D I don't, plus, yeah. I would like, I don't know about what, if I wanted to give this a passing grade. Chat, you guys think C? You guys want C? ASAP says C. Scotty says D. He says no Scotty C. Scotty says fucking D. Totally Spies needs bumping down to D. <laughs> oh, wait. So ASAP said D. Yeah, yeah. D. Rogue Fuck says D. Guys. Come on, man. What? And Cow and Chicken right, into C. Fine. <laughs> How does everybody think it's fucking D, man? Everybody. Scotty Scotty says bump totally spies down to D. And Cow and Chicken into C. No, leave totally spies where it's at. No. <laughs> I'll settle for fucking Cow and Chicken being D if you leave totally spies where it's at. <laughs> Sphinx, though, Sphinx, but... like says, oh, no, 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 like, I, I feel like being brave enough to be weird as fuck deserves a C. <laughs> yes, C. I would agree with that. C. It deserves a C. C deserves but again, C. I will settle for a D for this. One. I just can't. I can't do it. And I mean, yeah. A. You know what I mean? I hate it. Totally spies, it but it's a good at weird. C. Yeah, I think totally spies is good at C. Like it's just there. It's friggin' good at C, bro. All right. So the next one people want right now is that magic school bus action bro total drama island that had that was i don't think that was old enough i i was it was beyond my time i think i was too old i think total for that. drama island was like late middle school which would have been 2000s actually can no, you it was 90s and early 2000s so no i don't think i'll look it up real quick can I'll you check it when it was I mean, all you got to do is the year because we stopped at 2005 yeah, that kind of was like our little mark. And I never really um, watched Total Drama Island, to be honest. So that's why I think it was be, uh, like after me. Yeah, it was 2007. So that's why. 2007? Yeah, 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 we were. 2007. We were, 2007 I, was almost, I think I was, I was in high school at that point. Yeah. Yeah, I was, I was 16. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So listen, Magic School Bus is in my opinion <laughs> only reason is because you not only were made to watch this in school <laughs> you were made to do it like you were forced to fucking watch this it was actually enjoyable i'm i'm like i, I actually mean, liked magic school bus it was enjoyable because it was better than working in school other than that, that show is so fucking lame. Oh my god. Lame? No. What was lame about it? Again, it was one of those learning shows, dude. That's so boring. No thanks. In the not UK, I can see that not being in the UK. But like what's wrong with learning? I mean, learning's fine and all, but I don't want to learn more while watching TV. No. At least not a cartoon. Not a cartoon. No, I'll see, be... look, the UKers don't even know about magic. The books. UKers, they don't even know, <laughs> they don't even know it's a thing. <laughs> this There's is like true. three of them are like, I don't even fucking know what that. Like, I don't even know One is saying it was a thing. The other two are saying no. Well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I will say though, Rogue, I'm not putting an S tier. Captain Planet. Whoa, I forgot about Cap. How did we miss that? Oh, miss that one might be too list. old, actually. That might be why. Huh. <laughs> if, <laughs> if it was I'm about bitches. If Wait. Magic School was, was about bitches, Beauty would have put it in us. Goddamn right, this, He's not a school you. guy. No, honestly, man, I'll be I'll be completely like, I'll, I'll come at you guys correct. I personally think Magic School Bus should be mid level vibe, like after Cat Dog. Like I enjoyed oh. it, but like also never watched it outside of school. Like never. <laughs> yeah, I've I mean, I've I seen I've seen excerpts. Of like you know like literal like uh what's it called like people making fun of it mm. um but like maybe even see 
I don't know if I can put that A, bro. But like no, honestly, I'm putting C or B. I'm putting it B. I'm putting it B minus yeah. because it's gonna Very be last, best. bro. I can't I can't do like as much as I enjoy the magic school bus growing up, I can't put it at A, bro. Like look at look at no. look at what A is stacked on. Courage the Cowardly Dog, Samurai Jack, Powerpuff Girls. Some of you will say Powerpuff Girls was not meant to be there, bro, but I'm telling you, they would beat your ass for you thinking that, first of all. Bro, the best thing I remember about Magic School Bus is the memes that are coming out about, girl, that's a booty hole when the fucking bus goes <laughs> in the hole. That's it. That's not even the actual show, just the fucking memes on it. Girl, that's a booty hole. Song, was it? So you would put Magic School Bus over Totally Spies? Fuck uh, out, first of all. I mean, no, I would not, but if... I will settle for it being there. I'll settle for it being there. I don't think it deserves a fucking be though, honestly. That shit was so boring. So boring. I don't think it was boring, but it wasn't it was like so A boring, material man. though, you know what I mean? So no, yeah, I mean bro, I'll settle for no. it being a B though. I think they were broken for... earlier and I just didn't have the time to to like mess around with it earlier to see if they were back up. So probably not. Um so yeah, I I I'm okay with it being B minus. Yeah. And if you're okay with that, then I guess we'll, we can um, hold up. Power of Ghost was lit because of this one part when they talk about mistakes. That was funny as fuck. We uh, list each and then discussing it. Well, that was, that's part of the, uh, that's part of, we were going to do that next, Sphinx. We were going to do this together. Yeah. <clears throat> that was something that we were wanted to do this first. And then we literally talked about that. Um, yeah, we kind of wanted to just do it with you guys though and argue it over. Honestly. Yeah, like, talk about this I'm, and I'm do it this it, way. Honestly. Yeah. Um, but that's next. That's something that we were gonna do next. Uh, Sphinx. All right. So what was it? Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Oh. Bro, I, mm, mm. Whoa. What? I'm I'm just thinking. I was gonna say S immediately. Oh, okay. Okay. No. 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 I'm not putting it S. And. But I'm not. That one might have almost been a little too weird for me to give it an S. I think an A. I'm it putting was it really in A. Fucking good. I'm putting it in A. It was just, yeah. I, I mean, I, I, I would, I would personally I don't like put some it in of A. the animation. Some of the animation pisses me off. Like they're standing still, yet the lines are constantly <laughs> jiggling. I mean, when that, I noticed that, it fucking tore me apart. I couldn't stand seeing it after that. Oh my god. That was part of the reason. I think that was the art style that they were going in. But how many oh, people? Yeah yeah, 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 for sure. Tell for me sure. not. How many of you motherfuckers right now listening to this? All right, try to put a jawbreaker in your <laughs> jaw the same way they try, where it was like massively big. The I, bro, I always thought of this show every single time i could oh, yeah. like it was the like yeah you see look you see that's what i'm saying like he said yeah. gobstopper but yeah jawbreaker whatever it was called bro i don't know what it, it might be different um bro that's probably because they were they were illegal sphinx because like in this show <laughs> scotty and i we literally said the same thing he typed it i said it like literally like every i would tear my cheek trying to fucking do this dude <laughs> insane like it ain't and natural boy who it finished natural, one boy. i never finished one they were so big i never sat there and yeah, like you know I, what i mean i can't think of a jawbreaker that i've ever finished actually that they could be some kind nasty. of youtube video like just <laughs> yeah. just sitting there like whoa, whoa, until it's over <laughs> <laughs> of course scotty even though you didn't know you did he said it was effort of course oh that thing is it's kind of like it's disgusting, yeah, because it gets all sugary and fucking nasty after a while. Oh my god, I'm putting it in an says a. a. I'm putting it in an A. I can't yeah, put yeah. it in a. an S tier, yeah. right? And I'm putting no. it above, I'm um, or uh, uh, before Powerpuff Girls. Yes, I yes, can't agree. Don't think I'm gonna put it above Samurai Jack and Courage, though. I think A here. And the third tier here deserves a good one, personally. Yeah. 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 Plank. I forgot about Plank. Plank. Dude, Plank was oh the shit. You got to remember Plank. Plank. Don't, you remember the three girls that were always after Ed, Ed, and Eddie? Yes. <laughs> nasty fucking trailer girls. 
Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I man. mean they weren't the, too the, they what were, their names, the trailer something. Oh, I, I don't remember. remember their names, Biomi. My boy playing, give me him a mention. This raunchy. is true. You just put the top of your mouth. Oh my god. It was technically about Wait. bitches. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, a huge Okay. I mean What was Ed Ed and Eddie about? Getting money, sorry. right? It was about getting money. That's really all they ever wanted was money to, to buy, buy jawbreakers. Jaw jaw That's all the series was right. about. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like. <laughs> no. Like. Like. There's just no way I can do S on that one. I can't do <laughs> no, S. I don't know. I don't think it deserves an S. Yeah. Personally, I'm sorry. Look at this S tier. So. Above courage. So. Above. Like Samurai Jack. Now, there's one or two more on here that are gonna be S. I don't think. I yeah, don't think I would agree S. with that. I would agree with that. Uh, do we have a next? Uh, I don't think so. No. Okay, so let's go well, with ASAP. Said Dexter, but it Dexter is next actually. Anyway, it is kind of next, so we're good. All right. <sighs> what can I say about Dexter's laboratory other than DD get out of my laboratory? <laughs> I love that shit. <laughs> All the accent? time. What Dude, the that was... An <laughs> he has an accent, bro. What do you mean? I know. That's what I'm saying. But why, though? Like, there was no reason in that I... show for him to have a fucking oh, accent. Oh, oh. He's saying why. I think he meant why me. I'm like, because I said straight... it like him. Oh, this... yeah. <laughs> it was... Diddy. Diddy. <laughs> Omelette du... Du yes, fromage. That. I was just about to say, but I've been saying Ablé Duke Fromage for some reason. What? Every time I think Dexter, I think Ablé Duke Fromage, and then <laughs> this fucking YouTube video just takes me back, dude. Dude, well, who remembers uh, the episode where they were all different animals? Like they had a gun uh, or ray gun that transferred into like all different kind I of animals, and then they went into like class with it, like they just just like making everybody into an animal. <laughs> oh my god! For I just remember hating the shit out of his sister. I could not stand. For everyone that hated Dee Dee. Get, yeah. Like get out of here, Dee Dee. Get out of my laboratory. Fuck like, out of here, bro. Because Dee Dee was another one of those like I'm just gonna twirl and be cute and like that's mm -hmm. it. And fucking Dexter and was always smart about your it. Valuables, yeah. Yeah. Literally like I smash apart the things you care about. Yeah. I'm not putting. I mean, personally, I can't put Dexter in the S tier, but I would probably put him like right after Samurai Jack. I I really do like Samurai Jack. I personally, and then we're gonna we're gonna fight uh... about this later. But like I would personally yeah. put Samurai Jack in front of Courage and then put no. Dexter after Courage. Like right in between Samurai Dexter Jack and after Ed. Courage. So like and Dexter, Dexter would be right here for me. Where are you where are you putting him? In front of Samurai. In front of Samurai? Yeah. <sighs> yeah. You're not liking Samurai, huh? Croissant. Croissant. I mean, he was up there. Dexter was like, I just, dude, I just, I like Samurai Jack for, again, like, I think if you, because I did watch it. So I'm just trying to think of, like, no, now I'm trying to think of when I was a kid. You know what I'm saying? A wee little laddie. It was very different shows. It was, yeah. I mean, it, it didn't leave like a massive imprint, but I remember watching a lot of it for sure. Yeah. I enjoyed the shit out of that show. I okay. enjoyed the poo out of that. All right, we'll leave that here. We'll come back to it. Yeah. It's the fight's not over. Don't worry, Sphinx. The fight's not over. <laughs> um, we actually had one here that was another one of those later shows, at least from some of these, which was Foster's. Wait, did somebody say something about next? No, nobody. ASAP said Jimmy Neutron. Oh, he said Jimmy? Uh, we can go Jimmy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can do Jimmy Neutron. Bro, you start. Dude, I was thinking that. How the fuck did he hide that lab? Literally, how how did they not find out <laughs> at some point? I mean... <laughs> the man had it all Still... tricked out, bro. He had yeah. sensors everywhere. It was almost like Iron Man level. Like... Yeah. <laughs> that's true. That's true. Iron Man before Iron Man. He just had it. He was oh, ready for anything. Yeah. And Sphinx, I can't disagree with you, brother. I can't. 
But we'll see. We'll see it until the end. We'll see in the end. We'll see in the end. <laughs> Are you going to finish that croissant? Jimmy New... I know where Jimmy Neutron belongs in my heart. That show was... I watched a lot... So much. So of much. Jimmy Neutron, man. It was so cool. So much. So cool. There Obviously, was... homie looks like a dumbass because his head is so big. <laughs> but, you know, he's got that giant brain. And then his two friends... Like, the two friends just bring together that show so well. Carl just being... I love Jimmy's mom so much. <laughs> and then Sheen is an actual moron. It's actually Sheen. insane, dude. It's insane how stupid Sheen oh is. Oh, my he's God. He's creepy. Like, he's gross. He's kind of gross. He's low-key kind of gross. Yeah, but... <laughs> he's going to grow up to that like, uncle, that bro. picture right there, Sheen, Sheen's sitting there looking like <laughs> big-ass eyes, just staring at whatever he's staring at. Oh, Carl's like, looking at his mom, at Jimmy's mom. <laughs> yeah, 100%. Hi, Jimmy's mom. <laughs> I watched it so much, dude. Honestly, I even watched the movie that Catherine's talking about. Like, the movie was so good. It was just in general, like I really, I really did like the show. Um, I think you're putting it in S here. I'm putting it in S. I'm absolutely putting it in S above SpongeBob. Above SpongeBob. Yes. Oh above my SpongeBob. goodness. People, SpongeBob is more well known, of course, but this goes above SpongeBob, 100, percent 100 p. It doesn't have to be there, but that's my personal interest. Yeah, fair, that fair, fair. Because yeah. I'm willing because I did enjoy Jimmy Neutron a lot. And I mean, I watched... Do you remember his cube that was infinite? Like, you can put anything into so, it. yeah. Like, that was his one of his inventions. I actually used that and used it and just changed it up and used it as one of my... Like, we had a... Uh, in, in my college class, they were like, oh, for a business class... Oh, make something. Don't worry about physics, laws of any like anything. Just make whatever you want. I literally made that as our product mm -hmm. and I'm thinking in my head, Jimmy Neutron the entire time. I'm putting him <laughs> in S tier. I'm cool with um S tier, right? But mm -hmm. above SpongeBob, I have a hard time. I, I can understand that being like treason almost. I get but, it. I get it. That's the kind but of pushing it. The crimson it. chin. Oh my god, the crimson shit, bro. Okay, I have got to go. I'm gonna piss my pantaloons. I'll be right back. Right? Oh my god, Hold you better hurry. Down. I haven't I thought about the, the crimson shit. I got a real bad bladder, dude. In such a long time. Oh god, I'm about to make make me sneeze on that one. Yeah, chat. I'm putting this in S tier. I don't know if I can, you know, if we can put it past or oh, you know, before SpongeBob, but. Let me give you guys a little secret, all right? At the end, Samurai Jack is definitely changing. Like, there's no way. There's no way. The candies he made, I still want to try them. Oh, my God. I remember those purple. Oh, my God. This is why it's S tier. I do remember that. Holy shit. Catherine, my memory. You just fucked me up. Oh my goodness. I can't believe you just did that. Oh my god. What up, Game Freak? We're just waiting a little bit of a bathroom break here. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. This guy in his bladder. I, I I don't know. Like some of these I'm okay with a hundred percent. Others I'm not. I don't like Samurai Jack's positioning, chat. I'm I'm changing his positioning. It's gonna happen. Y'all rocking? What kind of question is this, Rogue? Of course. And when they all had superpowers too? Yeah. All right. We're Gucci. We're Gucci. We're Gucci. We're Gucci. They did. Oh my goodness, dude. They would like it's like zap them in their mouth and then like oh my god, I do remember that. That's so insane. <laughs> all right. Wait. So, what? Oh, Sam, what we got next? Which one? I believe somebody was requesting. 
Yeah, Scotty, we're definitely. I see your. Yeah, 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 no, no, no. The movie. No, no, no. I forget who. Somebody was gonna saying something next, but we can just go in order here. Foster's house. What's it? What's it called? Foster's home for imaginary friends or something? Mm -hmm. Well, Rogue did say. Uh, Teen That's Titans. Teen I Titans. Think. Oh my bad, my bad. All right, yeah. we can do Teen Titans. Ah man, I. That shit was so. Bro. Lego. Teen Titans. The original. The ori The oh yeah. Nobody ever yeah, think that about garbage. that new shit right now. Teen None Titans, of that. No. No. Hashtag like trash. Yeah, I don't like the Whatever animation that style was, for that. A little bit uh, that was living under a rock, honestly. <laughs> Dude, it's not not cool. Who's your favorite? Teen Titan, my favorite. I think Starfire. I loved Starfire, dude. Like, I want to like Robin a lot. He's kind of a douche a little bit. Beast Boy is funny and goofy, but I think Starfire's my favorite. That's the girl with the red hair, right? Yeah. I she always like Raven. She's got the green dude. beams and shit. Yeah. Raven was badass because, like, again, one of those characters yeah, just stay cool. quiet and then just mm -hmm. like come out of fucking nowhere. And like, it's like ah. Who was the you know the I mean? mech guy? Who was the the fucking big guy? Cyborg. That was his name. Wait, I think his name was Cyborg, wasn't it? I don't remember. I'm pretty sure it was. Hold on, let me look it up. Let me look it up for you. Raven Cyborg. is like Wraith. Facts. It is Cyborg. I think somebody said yeah. Let's see. Yeah, it's Cyborg. Yep. Okay, dude. All of them were just dope, and the combo and yeah. the style. I just really like when they they give me like side to side of like the style then versus the style now. I, I, what did they do? Stupid. Like, what did you do and why? Like, it hurts. Like, I don't know why that does, like, where that became a good idea. The story, the villains, it was always cool to watch. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. I liked it a lot because that, that was continuity for sure. That show had a, an end goal. Um, and the finale was great. You know, they end up together. No spoilers, but they end up together. It's like, Yes, Queen. <laughs> yes, even in Japan too. I'm pretty sure. If I remember right, they're in Japan for some reason. In the end, it's like, oh my god, yes, thank you very much. <laughs> I loved it. And the fact um, that they're just, they're they're not even in school. They're these fucking teenagers fighting crime in a giant tower that somehow was paid for. Who the, knows who the paid giant for that tea? thing? And built it. Like this giant T just in the middle of like whatever it's Iron Man Tower. On. Somehow like, that thing is there. It's just so tight. I I would put it in A tier. You putting it in S? I no, I'll go A tier. A tier is good. A tier is fine. I don't know if I can yeah. go. I don't know if I can go A tier or I mean S tier. S tier. No, and then I mean I I'm willing to put him put Teen Titans in front of Ed, Ed and Eddie before Samurai okay. Jack. Yeah. Fight me. Yeah. You sure? I mean, barely, but yeah. For, for what? No, Samurai no, no, Jack? Definitely, definitely, right, definitely. Right, right, right. No, no, no. Yeah, this is oh, good. Okay. This is good. This is good. Okay, That's right. fine. All right. That's, That's what we're fine. going with. And then, Scotty, I'd like to disagree. Ben 10 was not trash, trash. I enjoyed Ben 10. Beardy did not. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's Beardy okay. did not. I don't. I wouldn't say that was trash, trash. I enjoyed it. I liked it's kind of it. Boring. I don't know. ASAP took that like, what? Scotty, take that back. <laughs> <laughs> no, I enjoyed some of its episodes. Definitely and not one of my top, which Johnny is why it's not in absolutely garbage. Sorry, bro. Johnny, Johnny Test, Test is another sucked. one I didn't really care for. It just sucked. Yeah. It just, but I, I'll I'll say why I don't like shows like that when we get to them. I think. Yeah. Oh wait, no, we don't have. I thought we had Fairly Odd Parents on this list. Oh no, we didn't because I said I fucking hate that animation style. It's trash. That's right. It's garb. <laughs> okay. Uh, Shit, were you reading it? it looked like you were yeah, I was 100% yeah, reading, reading that, it. dude. But for can you do rocket power if you want? If you haven't, yeah, we'll do rocket power for you, Rogue. I'm not gonna lie, like, like I'm telling you right now, Beardy, I'm moving Samurai Jack to S tier as my final move. <laughs> like I'm telling you, move. as my you know, cause cause uh, like if we're gonna do the thing that Scotty mentioned, like I'm uh -huh. telling you right now, yeah. like I kind of agree with Sphinx. Like that, right, we'll I did. See. I did want it. I'm not S tier. I'd still put them uh, below Jimmy and SpongeBob, but above mm. Courage and Dexter. But that's we'll see. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, 
Yeah, I feel you. <laughs> um, and then let's do before he leaves. Let's do Rocket Power, bro. bro. Rocket Power was cool, man. Wiggity, 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 yeah. wiggity. I, I love loved Rocket Power. I didn't fucking care about the surfing. <laughs> I did like that they all did different sports, though. Like, they were they were good at all of them. You know, roller yeah. skates and surfing and all that. Just the skateboarding was so tight, man. I loved that one. Dude, skateboarding was my oh, shit. Man. And their dad had a fucking bar on the beach or whatever, and that was his job. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God, dude. And then there was the, so uh, the cool. uncle that was, like, the, like, the Hawaiian that dude. That's, like, a handful of people that have that lifestyle as kids i feel like it's so but, tight bro i here's the thing i was never good at those kind of sports those like like bicycle skateboarding rollerblading i was just like you know i used them but i was never good at them i always loved this show because it was like if i was good at them this is what i would love to be my lifestyle they would always just yeah ride and vibe like yeah, all, all the that time was bro vibe. it, it just was. really was like oh man it was good the whole point of that sh the show was to go and just shred whatever it was yeah. they was just yeah. have fun shred like i loved it like rocket power With that being said i would give that a b a b almost even a c no yes. way no i give it a b at the most it was just like it was really no. good and goofy, but it was just kind of basic. That's all they did was just shred. That's I can't do it. that low though. I mean, it, it, I it, it was a be, vibe. Yeah. It was a vibe, but I I, I got to put it at A. No way. No, Yo, it wasn't that no fucking way. much of a vibe, dude. I loved it growing up. I don't know, man. B. Oh my god. I'll, I'll put it if if we're putting it B. It's giving. I'll give it a B plus. Yeah. I'll Are you cool with like, a B plus? Johnny Bravo. For yeah, sure, yeah, yeah. Top the list. But I just don't think it was deep enough or monumental enough for me, I guess, to have it be over B. I just really don't. It was cool and all that, but that's really all it was. It was just cool. It was just fucking surfing and skating. I mean, there I were there were lessons. There were lessons that I yeah, learned from it. There was like it. a lesson like every 20 episodes. I don't remember so, yeah. them, though, but there was a lesson yeah, every now I, and then. Like, <laughs> I'll settle for B+. You know, yeah. I'll settle for B+. You know, oh, no. you know, ASAP is like ASAP. An yeah, a. he wanted Why, an A, dude. But... It's not that deep. Like it's just not that. It's just eh, eh. I know. I know eh. what we should do. Hmm. We should like each like do one of these and then come back and then just critique it. Like, yeah, how could you sure. put this one in S tier when it deserves yeah. D at best? Like, yeah. <laughs> That'd be a good one. Fucking D. Yeah, for real. Or have you guys have Chad decide one? That'd be insane. All right. So who who's next? What show next, Chat? I have lo fi making me so wet. Foster. <laughs> I don't even listen to this music when in like the regular version, but oh my god. This is very different. This is very true. I have Beardy, you know what? We're just gonna go. My child. Was, oh, that's true. That's very true. We're gonna go in that. order here, and we're just gonna go with Foster's. Foster's home for imaginary yeah. friends. S. So good, man. Foster's was so good, so unique. Literally a whole fucking house full of your imagination living together, and they somehow make it work. And then there's been debate I've seen on the internet whether it was all just, I think, at least I think I saw it, whether it was all just in somebody's head. None yeah. of them are even real at all. Yeah. Right? Like the whole show is potentially just somebody losing their fucking mind, basically. The girl. The which girl. Is just, the main character. Yeah, like oh my god, man! I did see that. Nuts. Um, Foster's was so good. No, I I enjoyed watching it a decent amount. Well, who was the guy's <laughs> name that had the the one arm? He's a basketball player. Um, wasn't it Wilt? I don't remember was names. This was a look, while ago, yeah. but like he was one of my favorite guys. Cause wasn't he the wise one or some shit? It was one of yeah, them that like was a wise one or something like that. Yeah, Wilt. Wilt? Yep. No, I enjoyed it. The grandma was one of the cutest little things. Um, they oh, would yeah, try to the hide. Granny, yeah, right. they try to hide it from her, all the things that they would do and everything. Um, personally, though, I don't think I'm putting it above uh, like anything in the A category. If it's going into A, it's going behind Powerpuff Girls. I could settle for it being last place in A, but it's definitely A, 100%. 100% A. Yeah. I like milk the fucking cheese. The, episode, oh, dude. yeah. Oh, my God. 
when I googled Foster's home earlier, it <laughs> brought cheese one of the, was like the top result. Yeah, I'm willing to put this in A. I enjoyed it. Uh, there's a lot of nice heartwarming moments. I felt like for some reason yeah, in that show. Absolutely. I remember. I don't remember. We'll go from there. <clears throat> yeah. Hey Arnold. Bro. I'm sorry, Bro. but like, I'll tell you right now, this is one of my top shows. Yes. I watched yes. this so much growing yes. up. Like. Oh my god. Can, I watched a lot of that as an adult too. Can I tell oh. you that I just want nothing less than his like what is it his attic room that he had yeah man dude he had the sickest fucking setup the illest fucking setup ever like i i yeah, wanted his room for the longest the time his whole roof just opened up yeah yeah it was such a good show i remember like, what was yeah. his friend's name uh gerald uh, gerald, gerald right gerald, gerald yeah. arnold mm -hmm. and oh uh what was your name Angelica? No, that's Rugrats, right? Isn't it Helga? Helga. Helga that's right, right, yeah. right. Dude, Helga with being obsessed and having like the watermelon. Yeah, that was that that shit was uh interesting for sure. I forgot oh about her fucking God. shrine that she had. Yo, I thought it was always so funny because she was like, I love you, Arnold. But then she'd be like the biggest and bitch to him. The hell out of him Yo, school, I the know. biggest bitch is like, how am I supposed to know you like me? Like what the fuck, that dude? His grandpa. I just did not want them to get together though. It was, she was so cringy. I did not want him to link. Honestly. True, true. Honestly, I'm putting it in S tier if that's cool with you and Jimmy. Like Absolutely, behind Jimmy. Bro. I, I. There's no argument anywhere on S tier. Hey Arnold can go. Yeah, except the in front of Avatar. But yeah, um, <laughs> yeah. I yeah. I loved Hey Arnold, dude. I remember the so good, the tree man. hugging episode for some reason when they were gonna go cut down like. A tree that they they love there's some shit and they put themselves into yeah i watched it a lot growing up the grand i remember the episodes about the girl he had a crush on that was like a year or two older because they really emphasized the shit her name was like ginger or something oh, i can't remember man. uh but he had a crush on a girl like a year or two older than him and whoo that, yeah. that shit was deep oh my god but I, I think in the movie he got with Helga anyway. It was like he did. Gross. He had, well because it's like you know they ended up having an attraction for each other. No, this is I definitely one of those movie. one of those um, Nickelodeon specials. I don't know like how yeah. how else to explain that. Like yeah. I enjoyed it and I just always watched it. That one and another show was like that was Doug. I actually watched a lot Never of Doug. Doug. That was a weird <laughs> one that I would it. say I watched it. I watched Speaking that one. Speaking of that, though, notice are all S tier is all Nickelodeon. All oh, shit. Oh, I mean, that from what's left, it looks like Nickelodeon took it. Yeah. No Cartoon Network yet. Anyway. That's wild, actually. Holy shit. Rocco's Modern Life. Uh, Rocco's Modern Life. That one I liked a lot. I would say, I mean, I don't think it left enough. I can't rank it high. Like, it was goofy and funny for sure. But I really just watched, like, the same few episodes, I think, because I had them on VHS for some reason. You had it on VHS? You know? I think so. I think I had, like, Rocco's Modern Life tapes. What? Me. Yeah. yeah. You guys have never seen Rocco's Modern Life? One of those, again, it's a little bit of a weird show. Yeah. Like, it's not terribly I, weird like Cow and Chicken. I'd give it either a B or a C, honestly. I'm, I liked I'm okay. it, but I could say it's a C. I'm okay with C because yeah. it was one of those, like, I can't put it as a D because the reason Cow and Chicken is there because it was a completely, utterly wild and just weird show. <laughs> but like, odd, yeah. Yeah, but I can't, I can't put, Rocco's Modern Life was like, again, it took certain problems that he had with work and just dramatizing. I don't know. I, I, I did enjoy it, but I think... Like it wasn't anywhere where anything else like these are, you know. Yeah. So I, I would think C, and I'll even put it below totally spies kind of shit. Yeah. What up, Eddie? Mm -hmm. uh, he had gender Wait, problems had too. Gender Did he really? Did he I even know? Hey Arnold, so I'm just agreeing right now. Hey, hey Arnold. I mean, it, you might not oh like it, God, hey but like Arnold. it's hey, it's hey, it's S tier for us because it's like our childhood. You got to realize we're looking at childhood now. We're not looking at we're like, like childhood cartoons, not like now cartoons you know what i mean so looking at this list i don't know if i wouldn't move johnny bravo to a 
Wait, who would move Johnny Bravo to A? Sphinx. Oh, no. Ew. Gross. I can't. I can't. I would. I would much faster move Rocket Power to A than Johnny Bravo. But remember, this is this yeah. is opinion basis. This isn't Shit, there's no I, facts. I could move Johnny Bravo down to C. Move it to A. Honestly. Honestly, I would probably do the same thing. Move it to yeah. C before that. Um. Mm -hmm. All right, Rugrats. Ah, S. Dude, Rugrats. Yeah. Right off the bat, S. Yes. Dude, oh, Rugrats yeah, was the Tommy. Um, what was his? Uh, what was his friend? Tommy, the, Chucky. Chucky. That's uh, what I'm Arnold. thinking about. No, not Arnold. <laughs> Chucky, fucking, bro. I can't remember their names. Rugrats like... is S. S. Goated, bro. <sighs> Rugrats is amazing. God, I, Every, here's, yeah, S, as S, everybody's yeah, an S, I said I hated Rugrats so hard. <laughs> he hated Rugrats. Sphinx? Why? Philip, those were the twins. Those were the twins, bro. Philip. And what was the uh, what was the other? Angelica was the 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 older girl. What was the other twin's name? I had another like like Rugrats shirt that I just didn't wear. Didn't Get out of here, have a Lee. Friend too? Wasn't there another? No way, dude. Like, oh, don't forget, um, uh, Susie. Was Susie was Angelica's friend, the the little black girl. Oh my God, Susie! Susie yes. Oh my God, true, dude. The grandpa was hilarious. Yeah, the parents. Was huge on that show. I would watch <laughs> oh, the man. news over Rugrats. You're Bugging. Uh, he's saying you're thinking of all grown ups. Wait, what? No, 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 no. Susie was in, in the, uh, and she was there. Susie was in the younger one for sure. I'm looking at a picture of her right now. Lil is the other twin. Susie was there. Sphinx, you dumb. <laughs> this is this is all opinions. Oh, uh, but you're I'm bugging. The news over Rugrats. <laughs> Jesus. I can't time him out. Susie showed up towards the end of Rugrats. Was it Dylan? Listen, we, we can't Dylan we can't help if, ever, if if somebody doesn't like the same shows you like. It's just yeah. funny because like like me and Beardy hadn't talked about which we thought were gonna be S tiers, and the only one that's not up in S tier <laughs> is actually just Samurai Jack. But like these shows were S tier to me the entire time. So like that's that's kind of I knew. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Stew Pickles is 1,000% a stoner, dude. 1,000% yes. oh a stoner. <laughs> that uh, man. A motherfucker oh worked for God. his weed, though, man. He Yo, worked so hard. He did. Oh, he was, my I just God. remember him being tired in, like, half of the episodes. Every the episode. But it's, it was his eyes. He would just always talk to you like this, yep. you know what I mean? <laughs> so, mm -hmm. I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> no man reptar was my shit dude do you guys remember the i actually dude i have a rugrats game on the n64 is it the n64 you have an n64 still stop what yeah i have an atari too bro what that goes way back no 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 well, the, uh, know. the other one it was a rugrats was it on the n64 or was it on the uh the gamecube scotty because i remember I, it might have been on the gamecube dude that was one of my like coolest games because I, I I just loved going <clears throat> you playing as like what was it to Europe or to London or some shit dude I remember that I, I, it was GameCube okay it was GameCube yeah I remember the Reptar missions dude I I haven't played that in so long I should see the if I Reptar can still bring mission. it on bro do you remember do you remember the orange uh video VHS. Does yeah. anybody mm -hmm. remember the, the, when they went to Europe, this, to London, I think it yeah. was? Yeah, that movie was dope. That, that movie, movie was, was amazing. Awesome. I, I must have so played good. that so... It was the orange fucking thing, dude. Oh, my God. That's 100% S so tier. Good. I kind of want to yeah. even... Be nostalgia, I might put it above, like, a couple of these. No? You think it's fine here? Yeah, I think it's pretty good there. I think it's good there. <laughs> It's S tier. If you really feel so inclined. <laughs> oh but, my god. Uh, I, don't I don't think, think I can give I myself pink Arnold. hair. Uh Eddie, I will redeem those, bro, but I do have a feature like Snapchat filters where you can give me pink hair, but right now because it's on the podcast, I'm not using slobs. So like I can't do it. I'm using uh um 
Discord call, so that's why I can't Fucking do it. Discord I just call. tried. It didn't work. <clears throat> Sorry, bro. <laughs> but, like, straight up, Rugrats is by far one of my favorite, like, as a child, and I still actually own them to this day. Bro, fuck yeah. I think so, too. I think I still have them somewhere. I know it. I know it. Just clicked it because it popped up. Yeah, no, that's a that's a good one. It gives me pink hair, bro. I I personally think Rugrats. I could I could put him above Jimmy Neutron. Game Freak says it's above it. Hey Arnold, I don't think so, man. Hey Arnold was just Hey Arnold was deep. great. Like, hey Arnold got in the feels, man. He actually thought about shit, and you know he felt. I sound like a fucking moron. He thought about shit, dude, and he felt. <laughs> no, nah, that's. Like, that's hey, fair. Was really like, dude, you know, I just, I just don't see it being above the other ones. I, don't. I can see, I can see your, your rationale behind yeah. that too. You know, fair, fair. I'm, I'm okay with keeping it in S tier like this. Mm. You know, it was, uh, <laughs> oh man, Scott, he had two blue bears as a child, named them Tommy and Chucky because of Rugrats. Love Tommy more than Chucky. Tommy and Chucky. Unfortunately, Child's Play hurt my interest in Chucky as well. <laughs> so true. Oh, God. That sucks. So true. All right. Listen, there's a person here that put this next one high, high. Danny Phantom. What say huh. you? What do you that think about this? sucks. What? It sucks? I think Danny Phantom is dog. It's trash. Oh, your play. What? I hate Danny Phantom. No I way. I fucking show. No. <laughs> Danny Phantom this, sucks. Cock, this is not is so part bad. of the deal. You did it not sucks. tell me this. Oh my god! I didn't know you thought it sucked. No way does it I suck. I think it's it's better because we were talking about Fairly Odd Parents. It has the same shitty animation style that I hate I, I, about Fairly Odd. Parents. I couldn't put Fairly Odd Parents because of this guy. I loved Fairly Odd Parents. Oh my god! Like, it's I, better than Fairly Odd Parents, but it's still. <laughs> I said I'd seen a lot of it. I don't think I ever said it was good. I said I've seen multiple episodes. I don't know why they were just on TV. But I Scotty, I got I got stopped with Fairly Odd Parents. All right, like literally, like stonewalled. He said no. I was like, what? He said hate, and I said what? I freaked out, bro. All right, it's the Bun Podcast now. No more beers. Danny Phantom is S tier for me in my heart, but that's all you guys, bro. You see, I can't put it in S tier. I wouldn't put it in S tier personally. Fairly Odd Parents, I would put really high, A plus to S tier. I love that show. That's me though. That's me though. Personally. Next podcast, guys. Something <laughs> weird happened, and Beardy can't participate in any more fucking podcasts. Sorry. <laughs> He's dead. He's actually dead. <laughs> oh, also, he's not going to be streaming ever again, so sorry. Yeah, <laughs> no. He doesn't have any content. Oh, dude, Chalk Zone was one that we didn't play. We didn't watch at all. Bro, I yeah, just can't believe it. It was one of them, it. but we just didn't really watch it. No. I, I think Danny Phantom, personally, goes in, and this is not, this, I'm going to have to fight for this one. It goes into low A, A minus territory. Oh. Yeah, A minus <laughs> territory, maybe B plus. I I just have a hard time, me personally, even putting Danny. Fa I'll put Danny Phantom over Fosters, but like maybe even Powerpuff Girls. Shit. All right, I'll put him over Ed and Eddie. All right, but I'm not putting it over Teen Titans and Samurai Jack. So this is you where I would put because the crowd demands it for sure. But Whoa. I think that shit is should be under cow and chicken. Uh, that's where I think it should go. Like I, where cow and chicken is. I you, think it should no, go under cow and chicken. Honestly, no way, sucks, dude. Man. No way. Oh, can't go above I at the edge. Say what Scotty says. Oh yeah, no, do not put it above Ed and Eddie. No All shot. All right, fine. You're I'll do crazy this. If you put it above Ed and Eddie. I love. Th I'll do this. There I'll do go. this. I'll do this. But damn, you think it's... All right, and here, edit, or, uh, Eddie, Eddie. <laughs> Shit, we put Cow and Chicken there because it was one of the weirdest fucking shows. And we kind of added Trash Know Your Place before we thought about that. We just kind of thought it was funny. But we yeah. just felt like it was one of those shows that was way out there that we watched but never really made it then. <laughs> it was like yeah. so much yeah. S here for me because it was a show I would watch every day, dude. I mean, I would watch it if it was on TV and I really didn't have anything else to watch. I just I just didn't like it, man. The one that hurt more than Danny Phantom chat 
was the Fairly Odd Parents. He literally mm. shit on that one so hard. I like I almost was ready to like Him's drive voice is more annoying drive to than Georgia. Anything, bro. More annoying than anything. And that was another again, one. Game I just Freak. hate that animation style. I fucking hate it. I I'm, I would have been here like spending thirty minutes trying to fight for Kim Possible and <laughs> Fairly Odd Parents. So I decided to be the bigger man. <laughs> Timmy is an average kid that no one understands. Mom and dad and Vicky always giving him commands. Bad twerp. Oh. Doom and gloom up in his room. It's broken in. Wait, broken instantly by his magic little fish who grant his every wish. Because in reality, they are his odd parents. Mm. Barely odd parents. <laughs> Come on. Wands mm. and wings, floaty crowny things. <laughs> Gross. And then he goes, it goes. I don't even remember this like that. Pea pod, buff pod, hot rod, obtuse, rubber goose, green moose, guava juice, giant snake, birthday cake, large fries, chocolate shake. <laughs> Bro, let me tell you what. I'm putting Timmy S tier for sure, a hundred percent. Don't even say sorry ASAP. Yeah, I don't ahead, even man, look at his shit, face. Man. Look at his face over oh. here. Look at Timmy. Timmy, fairly odd parents. So S tier, dude. No, nah, nobody. No, nah, I'm so telling gross, you. I'm telling man. you. Uh, have a good rest of your stream, yo. Sphinx, later, bro. Appreciate you stopping in, man. Letting us know what you did and didn't watch. All right, let's finish off this list before we go into anything else. Wild Thornberries. How did you feel about the Wild Thornberries? It was good. It wasn't amazing. I feel like I think there was a movie that was pretty good. Uh, I mean, probably a B. I like, catch it a was vibe funny with and it. Weird, but. Yeah, it was just a mid-level vibe, to be honest. That's a perfect description for it. I like Eugene. I wasn't crazy about the show. I think that was his name, right? Eugene Thornberry. Yeah. The fucking, the weird dad, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's definitely the main character without even being the main character. <laughs> Yo, um, Going animation style over popularity. ASAP. Historical. We're kind of factoring all of it in, though, really. Uh, Scotty, we actually agreed on Invader Zim. We... Watch that as adults, not ch children. It was a childhood yeah. cartoon, but we didn't watch it as a ch as a child. That yeah, show's actually no amazing. Enough, that show's amazing. We kept this <laughs> as to like shows that we watched during a kid, like when we were child, like children. You know, Recess ASAP. He didn't like Recess. I watched it. <laughs> I mean, I didn't say I didn't like it. It was average. I just didn't really watch it that much. Ariel Monster really was the same kind of thing as uh, Invader Zim, Scotty. I didn't really watch that. Neither did he. Not not a fan, to yeah. be completely honest. Sorry, guys. Yeah. It's kind of And then Thor Mary. Okay, so here. We'll put it on the catch a vibe. Uh, I'm willing to put it behind Magic School Bus. Yeah. You cool with that? Yeah. All right. First ever tier list done <laughs> by the bun and beard. <laughs> All right. Now that it is over, before we get into the one final move each, we have to go through honorable mentions. Scotty, I agree with this. You know what I mean? Honorable mentions mean like, yo, fairly odd parents should have been on here. And they would have been higher than Courage the Cowardly Dog. Just, just so you know, I would have fought tooth and nail. Tooth and nail for my fairly odd parents Fuck for no, Timmy. Man. Fuck no. Yes. Never. How, how you? How does that? Oh, uh, icky Vicky, you're so icky. Yeah, like, I hate it. Bro. Uh, how Even do you? That, hate I, I, I want to cringe when you sing that. <laughs> Gross. Ew. No. Ew. <laughs> what ew. the fuck, dude? No shot. No. There can't be an ew factor there. It's Absolutely so not. Oh my so god. Annoying. Everything about that show is just annoying. <laughs> uh Scotty, T Tom and Jerry was before our time, but yes, I we talked about that. Scooby Doo, neither of us really fucked with. I mean, I think he mentioned it. I told him I, I didn't really like I watched it a, I mean, like it a okay. decent amount. I think yeah, but it was actually pretty early too though. I think that was before early 90s, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, the well the early episodes yeah. cuz Tom and Jerry, I watched so much Tom and Jerry, but like uh, it wasn't on the list that we looked at for like early 90s um yeah. cartoons i feel hurt about recess dude i feel hurt about i still feel hurt about like um fairly odd parents dude whatever though 
The Adams Family? No, nope, that was another one I didn't really watch. That was a cartoon? I think so. Was it a cartoon? I know there was a cartoon rendition of it. Scooby Doo for real, don't fuck with that. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not a. Like, I liked don't it. Don't fuck with that, dude. But. How is Totally Spies on here when it came out in 2001? Well, so is Avatar. We we made it so we're right before high school. Danger. This is ba it's 90s to early 2000s. Is yeah. What the playlist is. Yeah. We went as high as 2005. 2005. It was 91 to 2005. Yep. 91 to 2005. Yeah. Really, the one that stretched it the most is Avatar. That sh shit was right on 2005. Yeah. That's where the line was drawn. Yeah. Dude, you can't leave Avatar off of that. It's a fucking impossible. Basil Brush? What? I've never heard of Basil Brush. What are you talking about? Basil Brush? Yeah, I never heard oh. of Basil Brush before. Yeah, I don't know about that one. But um, what other cartoons do you guys not see up here that you guys wish could have been up here? Because this time, this time around, we decided on the... You guys decided on the topic. We decided on the actual cartoons that we would lay out. Where for this next time, if you guys like this and you thought this was fun, maybe we can um, have it where you guys choose both the topic and give us the uh, all of the, like the like the shows and stuff, and then we could tier list that. But oh, dude, yes, Scotty, I knew you watched my Proud Family, bro. I knew <laughs> it, my man. The Proud Family was my shit, Scotty. Oh my god, he said he never watched it. He said he never watched I it. I don't. I maybe saw one or two episodes at the most. The, the Proud Family was it. my. Sh I watched it so much, yeah. And the other one was Hey Arthur. Arthur, no, didn't really watch that too much, bro. I watched a lot in school. So I, I watched, yeah. Arthur was like, nah, it just wasn't wasn't my thing to be honest but dude the proud family so much yes like i need to re-watch some of those episodes because that was my shit buffy the vampire slayer no never even heard of that i don't know it was a cartoon yeah never even heard of that i didn't know they made a cartoon of that all right so for this final one beardy how should we decide this what are we doing again we have a final move where we can just pick where we want yeah. to put one thing each, right? Yeah. You want to okay. go first? Yeah. So, if I could pick any of these to change them, you know. <gasps> Wait, how is TMNT not in here? Was that before our time? Wait, I B think tier? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is a little too old. It might be, it might be earlier from us, Scotty. We got, you got to think of like when it was, like. We might be wrong though. I don't know. I, I don't know. Up, but yeah, I'd look it up because I don't remember. There's two options for me. It is either Teen Titans being S tier, or Danny Phantom being right at the fucking bottom D. Oh. And you know what? I'm just gonna go Teen Titans being S tier because so many of you guys think Danny Phantom is quality. And I'll 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 let you think that sure, yeah we can leave Danny Phantom at A. So we're doing this Teen then. We're, on we're, S -tier. we're oh, all right. This can be up here. Yeah, it can be at the very end. I just think it's S. I think it's S quality. All right, and I'm moving, I'm moving Samurai Jack to A plus because I don't want to overcrowd S tier. Also ASAP. We said no Pokemon because I'm pretty oh, sure. Oh yeah, yeah, I yeah. I think it might be an anime. Like I think I think it came out in Japan first. Yeah. So we we uh we decided on like like Yu-Gi-Oh for example was one of those like anime kind of we we made that decision. Digimon yeah. we just never we never watched. I never fucking watched Digimon. Yeah, I never really fucked with Digimon, so we just didn't put it on. It would have been like low tier for us, even though. Anyone remember Pinky and the yeah. Brain? But again, that, when was that made? Of course I remember Pinky and the Brain. Animaniacs was on this, but we never watched it. I yeah. I did watch Pinky and the Brain, but it would have been probably B tier for me if I if I could put Some that of the ones one. we left off, but we just didn't watch almost any at all. Yeah. So that was also in the reasoning. Yeah, like Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu-Gi-Oh! is A tier for me. Uh, Pokemon S tier. DuckTales never fucked with. Tasmanian Devil, I mean... He had his own show? I thought, I thought it was Bugs part Bunny. of the... Well, 
the Looney Tunes. Or whatever, or, or, or Coyote, whatever the fuck it was. Like, uh, all those, yeah, like, just... Looney Tunes, bro? It's time to do, 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 bro. Ew. Such a... I, I really don't fuck with Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, my God. You didn't I have really a deck? Yu-Gi-Oh, man. You didn't have a deck, did you? I had some cards and shit. Oh, I really never knew how to play them. Well. I, my I, shit was so really... strategy. Like, I had so much <laughs> strategy, dude. It was actually Fucking insane. Nerd. I didn't really do it. Oh, my goodness. Shit. It reminds me of the, when I went to Mexico City. I found myself in one of those places where you can buy, like, any card that you kind of th- mm. can think of. And there are people dueling in there. Like, like the nerd. Um, like, literally, it was kind of insane. It was cool. Nerd Maybe an dumb. anime tier list in the future. The problem with an anime tier list is that it's going to be ran by Beardy. I don't, like... Yeah, he's not. He's not. I, I'm not the anime versed scene enough. I yeah, I'm not. I'm not versed in it enough. Like I've watched some anime that I, I have some say in it, but for the majority of the anime heads out there, I don't know what to call you guys. Um, it's no Franklin. Please. Franklin the turtle. No, didn't watch that either, bro. <laughs> I've seen a TikTok or two about him having an assault no, rifle. Those are the funny. The funny no ones, wonder. So no it. wonder Canadians are so nice. They watch Arthur, Franklin, all these very nice shows. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Animaniacs was another one that that we saw, but didn't really like. It wasn't strong enough. It really. wasn't strong. Yeah, it wasn't. Just didn't watch enough of it. Yeah. <clears throat> we tried to pick shows that we had, even if we didn't love them, we but watched a good bit of them. Just here's for whatever reason. Here's what I think should happen next time, though, guys. Is like we should not be choosing that because we kind of pre, like, made those like decisions before showing you guys and telling you guys about why so like maybe next time you guys will for example if we were to do another cartoon it's like you guys would choose all of the cartoons 30 maximum Mm -hmm. so yeah now that's the anime lovers names oh anime anime animaniacs animaniacs oh Oh, i see wow (laughs) i'm cringing in my seat oh pretty clever though it's pretty clever but we have our own name bro it's called being a weeb w-e-e-b it's already settled sam cringing Anime in my Aniacs. oh the woody woodpecker show oh my goodness yeah all these but were these the weebu um <laughs> yeah. were, what what year were these all made because again we the the cutoff was 91 no, barney's too old barney barney's definitely, bro. that's not a cartoon though that's just like a tv show it's gotta be animated <laughs> How could I forget no, Barney? They're, they're all just animated. Barney was yeah, that shit, animated, though. Bruh. 1999 to 2020. No, no, no. Oh, we man, did 91. Oh, really? Angela and Anaconda? No, I don't know that one at all. We, we, we scrolled over that one, but I hadn't seen it. Neither one of us had watched it. Yeah. Also, you still got to do your power move, though. I did. Samurai did? Jack Wait, is A+. Plus. Oh, okay. I, 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 I yeah. said I didn't want to put him in S tier because I felt like it was too overcrowded. Uh-huh. So. Yeah, there are a lot of S tiers, actually. Yeah. Really need a couple more Sajworthy slash trash ones, but... A lot of well, there's just, not, there's I not many. Magic School Bus could be fucking trash. Right? Oh so my! You said Danny that. Phantom could be trash. I can't They're accept garbage, your opinion, honestly. bro. They're not garbage. Fucking both. Oh gosh, my shit. god. Yeah, I didn't want to crowd S tier because then it's like S tier. S tier could be like two. <laughs> I see what he did there. S <laughs> tier. S tier this. King in the brain we missed but again it would have that one would have been for me in like the vibe maybe even c plus category rocco not the same level as i mean he's kind of got a point actually about that they are really similar but i guess i, just, I watched more angry beavers. every level yeah well, I, watched I couldn't more watch angry beavers than i did water life yeah you gotta realize there was absolutely no fact in any of this no stats it was just our feels yeah that's Our just, feels. Yeah. So it's like, yeah, this is not much. Sorry, guys. <laughs> the Pink Panther. I watched a decent amount of Pink Panther. Jeez, they said. Clearly, he watched the Pink Panther. 
But how do you guys? How did you guys like this? Do you guys want to see this? Do you want us to do this again? Maybe switch it up a little bit of how we do it. Maybe I we have. I thought this was really cool. I like doing it live. This was fun. I can see like making our own and comparing them, but honestly, I feel like we did that plenty just right here. Like, well, and the other cool thing. Doing it. The other cool thing that I was mentioning to Beardy guys is that this is an actual website, right? So, this is a website that you can go back and and just go through tiers and like figure out like maybe choose a random tier list to do and then just do it live so like that's something that we could uh definitely figure out yeah so for example scotty if we wanted to have a tier list like we can just choose a random tier list Yeah, and then just do it all live right, right on there. That'd be fucking tight, actually. Have the fucking crowd decide where it goes where, you yeah. know? Yeah. Danny at fucking D? Hell nah. What? Danny at D? Oh, yeah, that's yeah, that's Beardy. He, that's where he that's wants garbage, it. Garbage, bro. What up, Fester? Came in. Cow and Chicken writers were on PCP. Bro, they were on some shit. Mm, Cow and Chicken yeah. was such a weird show. It was really odd. It was kind of creepy. It really was a little creepy. Probably more than kind of creepy, actually. But if you guys like, like this, then creepy. let's do do a favor and let's like. Uh, how could Cat Dog beat Danny? No, Danny's an A tier, bro. Don't worry about it. Or Johnny Bravo. Cat Dog did not beat Johnny Bravo. But yeah, Cat Dog didn't beat Danny. No. No, Johnny Bravo also beat Cat Dog. Yeah. So the guys, closer to the letter, the higher rank it is. Let's uh let's flood our discords with what you guys want us to tear up next. Um and uh we'll be in talks about what we're going to do and then we'll set up something like this for next week. I think this is fun. Rocket Power should move up. Fester, I agree with you. Action League now. What is that action? What is Action League? Action League now. Action League now. I have no idea what it is. It's actually a good like show. Let's let's check the Google. I can't really check too much because. Oh no! I'm saying like I'm gonna check it real quick. Uh, is that a puppet show? He said it's it's, it's puppets. the one with action figure. It was so random. Oh, it's the action figures. Yeah, it's like a. Oh my god! I forgot about this shit. Lol. Ooh, that shit. That shit's kind of creepy. A fester, I'm not gonna lie, I wanted A. I wanted um Rocket Power to be A tier. I would put Rocket Power uh above Danny Phantom personally. Stop stop hating me. Um we both watched it, Scotty, and just weren't like the biggest fans of it. So that's why we left it out. Like we watched it, it didn't like it was a decent show. There's one or two funny episodes in there, but it's just so sorry, Chad. Weird, yeah, that's man. on that so we both weird. decided on that one. Sorry guys. We the it's, it's just, you know. <laughs> I, I I said I would ASAP. We could you know we could debate about it. You know? Oh the Shaolin, never anything. LOL. The Shaolin showdown. <laughs> I don't know, like robot chicken and shit, that stuff just kind of creeps me out. I don't know why, man. Like the the little dolls and action figures and shit and, and like oh, the for puppets, the lead it night. just makes me feel uncomfortable. I don't know why. Yeah, I'm with you, Fester. Oof. It was it was just not my thing. Those like like what was it? Uh, adult yeah. Swim. Yeah. Not, not my really. not my thing with Adult Swim. See, I, I'm with Fester, but he, you know what, Fester? I had to, you know, I had to compromise here. A couple things, you know. It's okay. Hmm. Let's stand by me. But I enjoyed this. This was fun, and maybe next time we'll do Very. it uh, like, like it a lot, with actually. different topics and different. Wasn't Danny Phantom a spinoff of Fairly Odd Parents? So I heard. So I heard, Fester. It was. This was a it, it new. Was, it, yeah, I've heard that new. Like it was, well, this and then that happened and then this happened and it's like, no, we we talked about the kids next door is missing this. Yeah, we fucked we, up we on fucked that up one. on we that up. one. That should have been on there. 100%. All, dude, we what did we say? Was that one A plus? That's at least an A tier. Yeah. Yeah. It's high A tier for candy. Yeah. 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 Danny's S for me. Fair. It was just a theory because there are a lot of similarities. Yeah, that's that's what it is. It's one of those things that just came out. He's absolutely like, I don't care. 
<laughs> Fair. But uh, Beardy, I think I think this is this is good, right? Yeah, I think we covered took all us the about basis. Two hours. It was twenty two hours, different yeah. shows. You guys were here, talked about shows and what was high tier, low tier. It is what it is. Guys, don't forget to go follow twitch.tv forward slash beardy sixteen. And uh we hope to see you next. What what? What Eddie Eddie? What, oh, I can't I can't just end the show like that. SpongeBob is trash F tier. The first Get, couple bro. seasons were great. The last all the other bullshit is trash, yes. But the first few seasons, no, they're amazing. Oh they're my incredible. god. They're so good, it's insane. They're so fucking good. Oh my god, Eddie, no! Trash the F episode with the jellyfish and having the fucking DJ Yo. party in their pineapple. No, that that was way too cool, man. Yeah. Loved it. <laughs> All right, that's way oh, better. No, that's way better. That's way better. That's way better. Okay, B B is way better. Not F. F is like that. Like damn, trash. Know your place, bro. Fuck. <laughs> All right, guys. But thank you guys so much for uh, for stopping by, giving us your opinions on everything, and hope you guys had fun. We'll see you next time, and don't forget to let us know what the topic for our next tier list should and will be. Mm -hmm. Later. Bye. Have a beautiful time. Hey, have a good time.